Hey guys, we are back with another video. I know I haven't posted in five months, six months, but right now is the time to shine on these does. Now I'm getting very excited, and I think everybody like you is getting excited. Every, every goat lover, everybody is excited to see babies on the ground. Now, the first one up is this lovely lady. As you can see, her uh, girl part is starting to swell and her udder is starting to get p perfectly large in size. Will you show us, girly? I don't think she'll show you very good. Hey, girl! Back off! There you go! There we go. We got a pretty good shot of the udder. But as you can see, that udder's getting pretty big. Also, this footage that I'm taking right now will also help me in the future of what her udder will look like a week before she kids or something like that. And then the second one off, I think is gonna kid first because she is gigantic. Look at that fat mama. So we have, our, we have them in these stalls. They're pretty large for some pygmy breeders. Uh, usually their pens are only Right there, cut in half so they can make two right here. She's poking pretty hard. Her tail is soaked with slime, but it's not time yet. But she is losing slime like crazy. And I also heard that when they do that, that they're getting really close. And the kidding date is on the 9th of 2020, of I think, I think September. I'll have to look again. Maybe it's probably not September right now. I'll have to go look. I will have to go look. But I'm getting very excited about this girl. So this is just an update on what the does look like. Will you turn for me? There we go. You can see that she's losing quite a bit of slime. Let me see that other girl while you walk back in there. She has a little bit of slime on her nose. We'll probably get her ready for the birth by uh, stuff like that. But I'm trying to get a good picture of her udder, but <laughs> she won't let me. I think I'll be able to do it. No, I won't. She doesn't like me to see her behind. It might take me a few seconds. Might have already got it. I have to look at my footage. So that's why I think that would be a pretty good shot for the ending. So I have 10 does ready to kid out. I know I bred the little storm, but I thought she was ready. I'm pretty sure she is. She's bred. But old Roxy here, she doesn't look pregnant, which I'm getting very worried because I bought a doe that is a grand champion, but can't have kids. I hope, hopefully that's not the case. Now you're like, that is an odd position for a pregnant doe. They might be in labor. Besides having sunken in, uh, she is way, she, her due date is not for like another month or so. <clears throat> but when a doe is getting ready, like her due date's getting close, when they have that and they're in a very uncomfortable position and they're getting backing up and they have slime and their sides have sunken in and their ligaments are lost, that's how you can tell if they're in labor, but she's obviously not in labor. Her ligaments are still there. Her girl parts are not as big as they should be before they give birth, but you know, some does are just like that. But I'm obviously getting very excited about all my does. So as I said, I have 10 does ready to kid in the next three months. Getting a shot of everybody's udder. Um, after those two kid, it might be bling thing here. Not, oh, there's some pretty good pictures of their behinds. There we go. Those are some pretty good shots there, girls. Thank you very much. Now, in nine days, I'll be posting hopefully a birth um i'm gonna start catching up 
on my videoing. I'm going to video my shows, hopefully, because last, last year I didn't. But, yeah. I know I'm only a 12-year-old, but, you know, I know, I know a lot more things than some people know about goats, which is pretty surprising. So, join me on my adventure because I'm getting really excited about these does giving birth. We could have, excuse me, we could have 10, 10 babies and more when these guys kid. Every doe sh could have one, but that is a rare, rare, rare possibility. So you kind of equal it to 20, 20 babies because some will have one and some will have two. I mean, some will have three and some will have two. So it might be a little more than 20, but... Yeah, so I hope you like this video. It's a little bit of a short video of what I usually do. But I just wanted to give an update on these guys. I will see you next time.